Hello and welcome to this explainer video series, Fintelect Simplifies. Today, we will cover some frequently mentioned terms in connection with cryptocurrencies. We will explain the difference between digital currency, virtual currency, and cryptocurrency. We will also define terms such as virtual asset service providers, peer-to-peer -peer transactions, decentralized finance, non-fungible tokens, unhosted wallets and hot and cold wallets. It is crucial for employees of financial institutions and other reporting entities to understand these concepts, so they can effectively track crypto-related transactions and be prepared to handle them when they occur at their institutions. We'll first explain how digital currencies are different from virtual currencies and cryptocurrencies. A digital currency is a broad term used to describe all forms of currency that exist in digital form. These can be regulated as well as unregulated. Some examples include digital versions of fiat currency, virtual currency, and balances in bank accounts. A virtual currency is a type of digital currency typically controlled by its creators and accepted amongst the members of a specific virtual community. It is generally unregulated and may not have value outside its virtual community. For example, in-game currencies, loyalty points etc. are virtual currencies. A cryptocurrency is a type of virtual currency which uses cryptography to enhance security. Cryptocurrencies operate as decentralized systems on a distributed ledger technology, called a blockchain. Bitcoin, Ethereum are some examples of cryptocurrencies. Virtual asset service providers or VASPs are entities that carry out exchanges between different forms of virtual currencies or between virtual currencies and fiat currencies. The services offered by VASPs include trading in virtual currencies, storage of virtual currencies, safekeeping of virtual currencies, facilitate transfer of virtual currencies for payment purposes and creation and distribution of new virtual currencies. Peer-to-peer -peer or P2P transactions allow two parties to exchange assets or funds without the involvement of banks, brokers or other traditional payment systems. These transactions can be processed via digital platforms like blockchain or P2P payment applications. Decentralized finance or DeFi is a financial platform built on blockchain technology, which skips the traditional banking and financial system altogether. DeFi platforms offer financial services like borrowing or lending, but on a completely decentralized system. It enables P2P transactions and allows users to have greater control over their assets and access to financial services without the need for traditional gatekeepers. Non-fungible tokens, or NFTs, are blockchain-based tokens that represent a unique digital asset, such as a piece of art, digital content, video, image, etc. An NFT clearly identifies the owner of such an asset. They are unique and cannot be exchanged, hence the term non-fungible. Unhosted wallets are crypto wallets that are not hosted on a registered exchange. They allow users to hold their cryptocurrencies outside of an exchange and hence give a user full control over their funds or assets. Hot and cold wallets are two types of wallets used to store cryptocurrencies. Hot wallets are connected to the internet, allowing quick access to funds and transactions. They are convenient and fast, but connectivity to internet makes these wallets more prone to security risks. Cold wallets operate offline and provide higher security. These wallets usually come as hardware devices that look like USB sticks. These wallets are less convenient and more expensive. Both wallets have their pros and cons. Hot wallets are generally used by more frequent traders, and cold wallets are generally used by long-term investors. We hope we have explained these terms effectively. We'll soon be back with another video. Thanks for watching.